Okay, you're going to use any one of the inputs that are open. I've used input 2. Then you're going to put one wire in your sender ground. And then from there, we're going to do parameters on the screen. You're going to go into your password screen, punch in the password 9876. You're going to go down to your input configuration, which will be in input configuration. Go to function 2, I've used input 2. Your remote start, your action should be changed to 3. Your sampling to 0. Your latching to 0. Um, your contact to 0. Your switching to 0. And your delay to 0. Once that is set, you move on to the next setting. You will then go into controller configuration. Open with last mode, change that to 1. Unit functionality must be changed to remote start. When the generator is in auto mode, you will see that the mains light is flickering because you've changed it to uh, remote start. It doesn't sense any mains. And once you make once you make the contact the unit will run. Break that contact, the unit will shut down.